Every decision you make in life has an impact on your sexual response system, including your ability to last as long as you want during sex or not. So in this video, I'm going to share with you five lifestyle hacks you can use to prime your sexual response system to be able to <sighs> make love in a powerful way and last much longer in bed without worrying about ejaculating. And I promise you, if you do these five techniques for 30 days, your sex life is going to improve dramatically and your ability to last longer during sex is going to shoot through the roof. Let's start with lifestyle hack number one, and that is to regularly stretch your legs and groin muscles. And I'm talking about multiple times per week, if not daily. And the reason is because tension in this area of your body is something that leads towards ejaculation. And instead, if you regularly stretch this part of your body, you're going to increase your openness there, your ease there, your relaxation there, your blood flow and your flexibility. And all that is going to guide you towards a more <sighs> relaxed, easeful, open sexual experience without tension. Lifestyle technique number two, do aerobic exercise regularly. And I'm talking about a minimum of two times per week for a minimum of 20 minutes at a time. Aerobic exercise is cardio. That's where your heart rate is up. That's where you're <sighs> breathing regularly. Go for a run, go for a bike, go for a swim. Do something that has your heart rate up consistently and that's gonna do a lot for your entire life and your sex life. It's gonna build endurance, it's gonna boost your happiness, it's gonna improve your mindset, it's gonna improve your neuroplasticity, it's gonna improve your emotional balance, and all of this contributes to a healthy, thriving sex life. If you start to get tired or fatigued in sex, your body is gonna to wanna to stop having sex, and the best way it knows how to do that is to ejaculate. But if you're strong and you have a lot of endurance and you're used to doing things for an extended period of time that might take some work, then your body is going to be much more able to last longer and continue lovemaking without automatically going towards the strategy of ejaculation. Lifestyle hack number three, stop masturbating quickly. What I suggest that you do is only from now on masturbate for a minimum of 20 minutes at a time. That means no more quickies in the shower, no more rubbing one out before bed. And the reason for this is because the more you masturbate and ejaculate in two minutes or five minutes, the more you're training your entire sexual response system and brain to see sexual arousal as something that should peak and come down in two or five minutes. And then when you get into a sexual experience with another person, your body's going to want to follow that same arc. So if you extend that over 20 minutes, your body's going to start to assume this is the new normal for sexual experiences and you're going to have a much easier time lasting longer during sex. And in those new masturbation sessions, treat it as a training ground for sex. Make it as realistic as possible. Touch your whole body. Breathe deeply. <sighs> Make sounds as if you were actually having sex with another person, and that is going to set you up for success when you do actually have sex with another person. Number four, reduce instant gratification in your life. That means less processed sugar, less chips, less junk food, less anything that's giving you an instant gratification hit. You want to train yourself to exercise willpower and delayed gratification. The more you're on a dopamine response cycle, the more your system is going to want that in sex as well. And you're going to see ejaculation as that quick hit of something that's, yes, it's going to give you those seven seconds of pleasure, but what is it going to do after that? Start cutting out processed sugar, start cutting out drunk foods, start cutting, cutting out Instagram, start cutting out anything like that, especially fucking TikTok. Fuck TikTok. You can have women up there dancing in G-strings where their asshole is barely covered and it's fine, but sex educators and guys trying to have open discussions about sex, they get blocked and banned. And it just blows my mind. Fuck TikTok. Don't get on there. <laughs> it's bad for your brain. Lifestyle technique number five. I could rant about that for a while. Stop watching porn. Do not masturbate to porn. This will fuck up your life. I'm serious about this. This will fuck up your relationships. This will fuck up your sex life. This will fuck up possibly the success that you're able to create for yourself in life too. But specifically when it comes to sex, when most guys masturbate to porn, they're just sitting there on a little computer screen and they're not moving, they're not breathing deeply and they're like moving their hand up and down and boom they ejaculate. It's not an embodied experience. It's not a connected experience. It's something that's done in isolation. There's usually shame around it. Most guys aren't going to want to go out in public and say, hey, I just whacked off on the internet and came. It was great. And because I think realistically, most of us know that it's actually not the best thing for us to be doing. Porn focuses on highly stimulating imagery, focuses on the cum shot, focuses on instant gratification. So it reinforces all that stuff that trains your system to go towards ejaculation during sex quickly. So just stop doing this. 
Stop doing this for 30 days and see how you feel. As a matter of fact, try doing all five of these lifestyle hacks for the next 30 days and see how you feel. See what it's like when you have sex. I can almost guarantee that it's gonna be different. And if you wanna watch one of my most popular videos of all time that will share with you a powerful, powerful technique to last longer during sex that you can use tonight, check out this video right here. It's awesome, it's easy, it's super powerful, and you can start doing it immediately. I'll see you there.